Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Pinterest, and especially over on ZachJackDan.com for all the photos you want of these videos. What's up, guys? This is Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about Every Venom Marvel Legends. So back in the Toy Biz days, we had a Sinister Six box set that gave us a Venom. Also gave us a Black Cat, Doc Ock, Spidey, Craven, Green Goblin, and Electro. Not a bad looking figure. As for days, we got the Sandman Biddle figure from the Spider-Man 3 movie with, to with um, yeah, Tobey Maguire. Had the Venom with his tongue out from the movie. Walgreens gave us this Agent Venom. Hobgoblin Goblin Builder Figure Way, we got the Anti Venom. Rhino Builder Figure Way, we got the Superior Venom, Doc Ock as Venom. Very sought after this one right here, has actually got a pretty good price on it. The build figure for this wave was the Space Venom. It took all six of these figures to build him. Absorbing Man build figure gave us our Venom with the green tongue for some reason and the regular face. And pretty much re-released, you got this one again, but this time you got the Eddie Brock head on him. And the symbiote kind of coming up around his neck. And of course, in the same way, which is a build a figure, um, we have this pork rind that you can build with that same Eddie Brock body and the spider ham figure. You got the pork rind head. And the build a figure for that way was the monster venom. Had to get all six of those figures to be able to build him. So then in the GameStop exclusive days, which didn't end up staying at GameStop, we had this back in black Deadpool with the Venom head. Or Symbiote head, I should say. And then Marvel Unlimited gave us this exclusive Punisher Venom. Coming soon, this year, 2019, you got this Agent Anti-Venom. So just announced 2020, we're getting the Monster Venom re-released with a repaint, coming out as a fan channel exclusive. He's going to come with more of a black wash than the purple wash that the original had, Richard and Bill figure had, and the spider logo on the chest is completely different. So here's the comparison between the Monster Venom build a figure and the Deluxe Venom figure. Both are great in their own way. Here is the Sony Tom Hardy version of Venom. Coming out in the Venom Pool Wave. No build a figure pieces. Two different head sculpts. Here's a closer look at those two different head sculpts. One closed, one open with a tongue coming out. And then one of my favorite reveals of the day is the Null and Venom 2-pack. And this isn't just any Venom. Check out those wings on Venom. King in Black is what this 2-pack is called. Null is a larger scale figure. Of course, Venom is as well. This will be about an $80 2-pack. No plastic either. There's a the front and the back of that package. And as you see, both of them do come with extra head sculpts. you got the teeth and the tongue on the Venom and the teeth and the no smile on the other head sculpt for Noel. Hair is different on both for Noel, but check out those wings and check out that venom. That venom is awesome looking extra set of hands. You got the sword for Noel as well. This is an awesome two pack, a must have. There's that sword, necro sword, the back of the wings, how they plug into venom's back. That tongue is awesome. Those teeth for Noel, check that out. 
this is an amazing two pack probably the best thing I've seen and you can see when the pre-order was back in April 2022 all right here we got another three pack with venom in it a couple more symbiotes Amazon exclusive you got Venom, Eddie Brock's head right there with the Venom head sloughing off of it. I love that. Riot and Agony. Riot, this massive figure here. Has a little blade accessory. You have another head sculpt for Venom. Extra hands for him. Fisted and open. And Agony has open and fisted as well. There you see the box from both sides. Plastic free, of course. see those two different Eddie Brock or Venom heads very cool tongue on this particular Venom and here's the back of that Venom just in case you want to see that next we have another two pack here fan channel exclusive I think it was actually a target exclusive with Space Venom and Mania. I just got mine in the mail finally. You can see he does have extra hands or spikes there. He's got extra head that's more aggressive. But it does come with a regular build a figure head too. There's your Mania. Very cool two pack there for these two. that aggressive head that angry looking space venom head got the emblem on space venom's arm there you see the uh, blades actually just hook on on top of his hands there's the package again plastic free Back of the package, side of the package, two different head sculpts. And then back in the Spider-Man Classics days for Toy Biz, you had this Venom with the symbiote kind of coming off his body. Very cool looking figure. Still fits in the collection these days. So in the Spider-Man Classic Series 4 in 2003, we got the Venom. And this particular time, he actually comes with this base. The stand looks like a symbiote attacking somebody on a wall. And it had this ooze that you could actually put at the top of it. So interesting enough, they re-released that Venom um, in Series 12 in 2004 of the Spider-Man Classics. But this time they did not give him any of the ooze. So I'm not sure what's up with that. And then that same Venom was re-released again in a two-pack with Spider-Man. Plus that uh, Venom with the symbiote costume was released as another two-pack with a, a different Spider-Man. More like a Ben Riley Spider-Man. Another Venom symbiote blast version. We're bulked up, longer tongue. Got the clear variant of that one. Stealth Venom, they call it. Another Venom, kind of different color scheme on him. Called this one Jaw Slash. I'm not sure why. I think he had a button on the back. You can kind of make his jaw go up and down. And then you got the Scorpion Venom, Matt Gargan. And that scorpion tail on the back of him. So in the Spider-Man Origins line, you had that Venom again. This time a little bit repainted, but the same body re-released again. And then again, in the Spider-Man Origins 2-pack. They love this, uh, this particular mold for this Venom, I guess. And then here was from the Spider-Man Trilogy series, the Spider-Man 3 Venom. And just because I've had people say something about this, I'm going to throw this slide in here as well about this limited edition 
uh, Spider-Man 3 series. These are not 6-inch figures, so that's why they're not really included in my list. So here's all the Venoms that we've had so far loose, so you can kind of compare them all. Yeah, they're all in package. So as a wish list or most wanted list, I'd love to still see the Tom Hardy version of Venom, especially with the split face like there. There, I know we've seen the Venom himself, but never seen the actual Tom Hardy face. Uh, I'd also love to see the red version Thunderbolt Venom, which I know came out a little bit. Um, or somebody customized, but I'd love to see these red stripes on him instead of the white that we got. And then definitely we need to get the bride of Venom. What do you guys think? So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. A thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys later. And guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Pinterest, and especially over on ZachJackDan.com for all the photos you want of these videos.